Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this platform. And uh, before you watch, kindly make sure you click that subscribe button. And that is the only way you can support this channel. Also, uh, when you open my channel, Apo mahali kuna jina roja sika kasungura. Kuna button imeandikwa join. Kuna jina imeandikwa po join. Click that name and follow the instructions. From there, you, you will be directed to how you will be supporting this channel. Ladies and gentlemen, the Azmio supporters across the world were waiting eagerly for tomorrow. But um, while Odinga, through Opio Wandai, has issued a message to the Kenya, to the Azmio Laumoja, one Kenya Alliance family. And uh, this is the message from Raila Odinga through Opio Wandai. This evening, the leadership of Azmio Laumoja, one Kenya coalition party, met and agreed to once more suspend the mass protest that we had earlier scheduled to continue tomorrow. The coalition took this step following the decision by Kenya Kwanza to accede to one of our demands that informed the resumption of the mass action. Instead of holding the protests, we have summoned our seven-member delegation to the Preparation Committee for fresh instructions to inform further engagement with the Kenya Kwanzaa side. As a party, we express deep gratitude to all Kenyans who have participated in demonstrations in defense of justice and democracy in our country. We also wish to reiterate that we will not hesitate to resume mass action at the slightest indication of lack of goodwill and honesty on Kenya Kwanzaa side. More importantly, we send a very strong warning to Kenya Kwanzaa over interference in the internal affairs of Azmio and its affiliate parties, including Jubilee. Tomorrow, the 4th of May 2023, we expect nothing but a very clear and categorical communication from the Speaker of the National Assembly on the decision by Azmio to remove the former Deputy Minority Whip, Sabina Chege. Any departure from our expectations will have serious consequences. We must end the culture of political prostitution in this country at all costs. Signed, Honorable J. Opio Wandai, MGHCBS MP, the leader of Minority Party National Assembly. Now, ladies and gentlemen, from this press statement, there are a few points I want to pick before I explain what I'm explaining to you tonight. One, from that press release, Opio Wandai is saying, yes, the Kenya Kwanzaa government has agreed to their demands. This was the demands. You know, as Mio announced the resumption of mass action when the Kenya Kwanzaa team showed 
and seriousness to the bipartisan talks. It didn't show any signs of goodwill towards the team that was selected to lead a bipartisan talks. From that, the chair from the Azmio side, that is Atiyan Amolo, came in public and said, they have tried their best to reach the Kenya Kwanzaa side and everything flopped. There is no response. There is no leader for them to engage. And they ruled out and said, these guys from the Kenya Kwanzaa are not serious with this work. What do we do? Let us go back to the streets. Now, this was the demand from uh, Azmiola Lamoja. And this is a press statement from Stephen Kalonzo Msioka. We in Azimio, I want to read this and connect it with the one from Opio Wandai and tell you what next. We in Azimio La Umoja One Kenya announce on a without prejudice basis that we are prepared to go back to the bipartisan talks with our opposite side in Kenya Kwanzaa and are prepared to stand down the demonstrations scheduled for tomorrow, Thursday, 4th May 2023, provided that Kenya Kwanza recurses Honorable Adam Kenan from the Bipartisan Committee and immediately announces his replacement on the said committee. This was the offer I made on Sunday at the Cathedral of Press Ministries International. All our other conditions remain the same. So, the demand from Azmir was Aden Kenan to be removed from the Kenya Kwanzaa by person team. And today, William Ruto has succumbed to the pressure, he has succumbed to the demand, and Kenya Kwanzaa has announced a replacement for Aden Kenan, meaning William Ruto has also bent low. Zakayo ameshuka tena chini kidogo. Kwanza, Zakayo alishuka kutoka kwa mkuyu akasema, sasa nataka tuonge. Aliposema nataka tuonge, akachagua kikosi cha madharau ambacho alikituma kwenda kuzungumza na kikosi cha Raila Odinga wakati alichagua kikosi cha madharau azimio ikasema kwa sababu kikosi chako ni cha madharau wacha kikae ayo mazungumzo hatujataki wacha turudi kwa barabara wamerudi kwa barabara jumanne jana na pia walikuwa wamepanga kurudi barabara kesho alhamisi lakini kabla ya kurudi Kenya kwanza imesema ndugu zetu tuliwafanyia mchezo ndio lakini sasa tumekuwa serious kujeni sasa tuongee azimio ikasema kama mmekuwa serious ni sawa lakini kuna mjamaa mmoja kwa hiyo timu tunataka aondoke mara moja na huyo jamaa ni Aden Kenan Kenya kwanza imesema yes baba tunatii amri imemtoa Aden Kenan wakati imemtoa Aden Kenan kwa sababu that was the azimio's concern azimio imesema kama mumetii amri yetu ni sawa wacha turudi tena tukae na pia mkileta tena nyefu nyefu tena tutarudi kwa barabara ndio maana opio wandai ametuma onyo kwa Kenya kwanza akisema tumekubali kwa sababu mulikubali na maagizo yetu na sasa tumeheshimu wa Kenya tumesitisha maandamano kesho alhamisi lakini katika hali ya kuzungumza mkileta tena siasa ndani 
tena tunarudi wapi barabarani kwa hivyo kutoka kwa Kenya kwanza kutoka kwa azimio ninavyozungumza kesho hakuna ma- ma- maandamano baba amesema kesho wacha tuketi chini tungoje baba anasema nini kabla sio sio endarex village gentleman mungu akubariki sana